Here comes Mackenzie Fisher, four seconds left. Moving in and hitting with one second left. Yeah, so we had a great team win today against UC Irvine. Then after, uh, we had our little bus ride back, all super excited because last night JT told us that we were going to be, uh, NECA was going to be our honorary captain tonight. I'd known about her, obviously. I mean, she's a big deal at Stanford. And then her younger sister, Shanae, I heard a lot about her. And they had created the Nerd City, Nerd Nation videos. And I remember before I came to Stanford, I saw those videos and I was like, this is so cool. They're making nerds cool. Like, they're like these great basketball players but also can like make a music video and obviously just a great role model for female athletes. I tried to like put the song together and I was like Chine I'm a bit more musically inclined. <laughs> so like I wrote the whole song and oh, then wow. like I told her how to rap her side and then like I rapped my side. It was like it was like like Def Jam. <laughs> <laughs> I have the pleasure of introducing NECA. So as you know, obviously Stanford alum, she also majored in psychology and is a three-time um, All-American, had four Final Four appearances in her time at Stanford, number one overall pick in the WNBA draft. And then in 2016, um, she's a WNBA champion and the MVP. All right, thanks, that was awesome. <laughs> you, actually, you actually told my sister some things that she didn't know about me. <laughs> just wonderful being here. It's always great being with Stanford family. I understand that you guys are trying to do something really big and uh, I've been in that situation a plethora of times and I say that because a lot of times people will look at me and they say oh you went to the final four four times but you never won it you know um, and that kind of stuck with me a lot but I, when I started looking at it from my perspective, I used to think about how hard it was each time to get there. And there's people that can't even say that they've been to a Final Four. Not to say that that's where I wanted to end my season, not winning a championship, but to give yourself the opportunity to do that, it, it, it doesn't just come every day, you know? And when, um, when I was able to kind of bring all those feelings to a surface in 2016 when we won the championship. When you, when you get to the top, you don't really think about the top. You don't think about the pinnacle. You think about the terrain and the slope that it took for you to get there. You think about the pain, you think about the pleasures, and you think about, most importantly, sticking together. Um, I used to tell my teammates at Stanford, no matter what, do it for each other. And then Thank you so also much. a Stanford water polo t-shirt. Yes. She's gonna steal these from me. I already know. Thank you so much.